Hi, Andrew. How you doing? Back Andrew? again. Back again. <laughs> How was your experience today? Yeah, it was good. It, <clears throat> it was kind of um, like I kind of knew the path because mm. my first time it was like I was almost like hanging on, and then just had to let go. But this time I sort of was able to get into that space much quicker, mm. and it's kind of what I'm feeling is like it's just getting back to our sort of true blueprint and it's just dropping the layers of all the stuff we've accumulated and the beliefs and the judgments and the patterns and the imprints and the traumas and the, it's just one by one and that's what I think we're holding in our bodies which are kind of restricting us and I just got this message that you know we are living at a really amazing time in the universe I mean, but what's being put out there is is one story, but you know, what is actually going on on a personal level, I think what we have the opportunity to do at the moment is to really grow and evolve if we want to, because the energies are there and allowing us to step into that. Mm. You know what I mean? If we just stay out of the surrender. fear, <laughs> surrender, stay in the heart. Mm. And it was just, for me, it was just more about just like, really just coming back to myself, my authentic self, and just, you know, just being that person I want to be. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's Without nice experiencing your journey, because you know Peter was here, here before, and you're here, and yeah. I've seen your growth as well. Yeah, yes, that's, that's beautiful. To yeah, see yeah, yeah. Thing. It's like I'm more comfortable with myself now. Okay. I've spent my whole life kind of being, I don't know, something else. Yeah. But it's like you're just stripping all this sort of stuff off, and you're just left with this Andrew. Do you know what I mean? It's like I actually like Andrew now. I love Andrew, Lovely. and I'm cool with being in that space now. Do you know what I mean? And I think there's amazing opportunities in this new stuff that we're coming into, because I think we're, there's this, you know, we're in a massive transformation, totally. the planet, mm. and, you know, there's many ways to come through it. Mm -hmm. But I think one of them is like, actually just stripping away a lot of the stuff and just coming back to you. And then you're in a much stronger place to be able to navigate what's going on. But you've got to know yourself <coughs> rather than projecting and taking the fear on and all that sort of stuff. Did you notice a difference from last time you were here to the session today, the two sessions? What? Yeah, I think there was a level of control okay, yeah, that I that. had in the first one where I just had to let relinquish control. Mm -hmm. And I think that's kind of, you get in life and you just, you're controlling your experience every day. It's like you're just on this routine of existing. Yeah. And it's, it's like when you step back from that and think, am I happy in that existence? And then you start seeing all these opportunities start. I had a lot of, a lot of ideas coming to me. I could, see, mm -hmm. I could see this sort of system working in Mexico and yeah. you know, taking that out there and you know, just a really, I mean, I think this has got to get out to humanity. I really do, like I've tried a lot of things and it's just like, <laughs> this is the, the highway. Okay, nice. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> to get to the crux of things without mm. taking, you know, hardcore stuff. Yeah. I mean, you can do it that way, but it's really good for helping. I want to combine it with heart opening work for men, mm -hmm. just getting people to get out of their heads into their hearts mm -hmm. and work on that level. And this, you can do it really quickly and just, you have no, you, you can't resist. You just have to surrender, do you know what I mean? And then it just happens. So yeah, it's been another magical experience. I'll be back again. Okay. <laughs> I kind of find it's just like, it's like getting upgrades, system upgrades okay. in your operating system of consciousness. Do you know what I mean? Like we're just, it's being more finely tuned. So you can just start receiving more and feeling more and okay, sensing more. Nice. You know what I mean? Yeah. As you just drop away the old yeah. stuff, which is just kind of keeping us bogged down. Yeah, totally you know, these realities that are no longer really working. No, I mean, that's the mixture of the gongs, the, the light, it's how I describe it is, you know, stimulating the five senses to activate the sick, you know, and, yeah. and journeying. And everyone's experience, as you heard already, is, you know, different. Yeah. And that's that's beauty. It's nice to be in that group setting. I think people love that. I get more bookings this than I do one-to-one -one because people feel like they want to be part of something. Yeah. And the second one was definitely a different energy. It was kind of, it was almost bringing up stuff I didn't particularly want to look at. Right. Whereas the first one was kind of a bit more sort of euphoric. Or not euph it's kind of... You know, it's very visionary and, and sort of creating, whereas this one was like sort of looking in the corner. The second one was sort of like 
looking in the depths of stuff I don't particularly want to look at and just sort of seeing that come up and letting that go. It's like no longer serves me. <laughs> Good. Let that go. But it was a different energy. Lovely. Yeah, but it's lovely. Oh, Once you sort of allow it to just travel through you and yeah, no, I was blown away again. Thanks for your, your feedback. Thank you. Thank you.